is unbelievable. I'm in Jerusalem, and I see in a toy shop over here, David Drez Dresden, a known sexual abuser, is working at a toy shop. I'm gonna go and confront him. Did you ever um did you ever did you ever approach these children and get did you ever approach these kids and get I can take a picture of you too. Yeah. You sexually abused children in New York and now you're working at a toy store. That's pretty unbelievable. If you have to make a living, that's fine, but there's many other places to make a living. There's many other places to make a living. All right? Do you realize what you've done to these kids for your... Did you ever go and approach them? Did you ever try to apologize? Ever try to pay for their therapy? Do you realize what you did to them? The trauma that you might have caused them? Do you realize that? No, no, no. Yes. Do you realize the lifetime of trauma, of shame that you caused? Yes, I'm going to say this, and I'll say this to the victims who will be watching this. I'll say the shame is yours. The shame is not theirs. They had no control. They were children. You took advantage of your, you took advantage of their youth, and you sexually abused them. And now you're working at a toy store, which children come in the whole day. Unbelievable. The shame is yours. It is not the children. It is not the victims. The shame is yours. Please, please. Outside, please. All right, we'll take this up, uh, we'll take okay, this up later. Okay. After, after, okay. Come in after, okay? Come in after, okay?